So uh, yesterday I uh, decided to use the convection oven for the first time. I thought I might document some of the things I did. Uh, I've removed the revolving tray and it's over here so we can see it better. Um, this uh, tray comes with it and the idea is to lift uh, whatever you're cooking off of this glass revolving tray so that you get heat underneath it, a convection oven. That's one of the advantages. Um, this can be reversed and uh, I'm, I, to be honest I'm not 100% sure uh, which is best. I would think that a deep dish would have to go on this surface so it's not too close to the heating elements above. But I also use these pans. These are uh, baking pan, a non-stick. Purchased a couple of those and as you can see they fit in there just great. Um, this is about an 8 inch diameter um, but if uh, I'd suggest anybody measure this uh, the interior of their convection oven and see what's going to fit. And this is large enough uh, for smaller portions. I have two of them and so I can uh, swap out cooking stages if you will. The other thing I used yesterday was a meat thermometer. I have a small portable one. Uh, everything in my class B is small and portable. <laughs> uh, fairly not too expensive and uh, I think this is uh, an essential tool for experimentation with meats. But anyway, uh, all worked very well. Um, this convection oven uh, has two several settings. You have convection and you have roast. I'm, I've read the manual. I'm, I'm not. I assume the roast. I'm not 100% sure about the distinctions, but I assume the roast turns on this upper element. Um, and that's what I did yesterday with the chicken. So I set convection. I push the button for the temperature. Uh, let's say 375. Hit convection again. Now enter the time. 20 zero, zero would be 20 minutes press start and away you go and this will give us an indicator of the actual temperature at which will begin to rise this is the set point um, we'll stop that to do roast once the chicken was nearly done it wasn't quite brown enough so then I did roast roast is the same thing I set it at 400 press roast again to set that in and then the time again, so I went with 10, 0, 0, and start. And there we go, we're in roasting mode. And that was all there was to it. So, it worked out really well. And I used the meat thermometer to verify that it was actually done. Bon appetit. Today's uh, experiment is going to be the first use of the convection oven and we're going to do a couple of uh, chicken quarters. Uh, these have a little homemade marinade, uh, olive oil based and, uh, and uh, our uh, road truck came with this uh, high point convection oven and uh, I'm going to give this thing a shot. We've never used the convection oven portion. So here we Okay, we're going to try cooking this thing in the Convection oven for 15 minutes, see how it does. Convection, 375, convection, and we'll go for 15 minutes, 1500, start. There you go. Uh, keep an eye on it, we'll see how it does. Cooking the music. Spanish rice tonight. With chicken. Our convection oven experiment. Three minutes and counting for the chicken. 375. Let's see how this does. Meanwhile, 
Georgina is strumming along while I'm cooking along. It's rather intoxicating, isn't it? <laughs> I'm waiting for the lyrics, but I don't think so. <laughs> Honey, I think I burned a chicken. No, no, no. Just kidding. <laughs> Yep, the rice is simmering. It's probably time to turn it down, the heat down just a little bit. As a ch turd, as a chicken whirls. <laughs> <laughs> Cooking away here. And the Spanish rice is simmering as it should. Yum, yum. Now. We'll let it cook for another 15 20 minutes. Okay, to finish this little thing off, I've gone to the roast function. Uh, I've set it at 400 degrees, and uh, let's see how this works. Seems to be cooking. I hear it sputtering. Uh, it's all about the challenges of figuring out how the technology works. Whoop, phone calls, gotta go. Okay, uh, let's see how we're doing here. Ooh. Okay, so I uh, began this on the convection setting, and then I switched over to the roast to brown it. And I did that in part because uh, this had, chicken had been at about 45 degrees, which is, I prefer to bring it up almost to room temperature before I cook it, but it looks and smells good. And, ooh, the rice looks good too. I think it's time to serve dinner before my ukulele playing spouse goes crazy on me. <laughs> it looks like uh, Oh my like, God, that's beautiful. That's what happens when you starve them. You know, they say, oh my God, it looks oh, so crispy good. chicken. Aromatic rice. Our first convection oven experiment, and the phone's ringing again, but it looks good. Okay, looks like. Uh, it looks delicious. Dinner. She says it looks delicious. He keeps well. taking photos. Please, sir, may I eat now? <laughs> Please, sir. <laughs> She's a hungry camper. I guess it's a success. Bon appetit. <laughs>